All right, so we're doing something a bit different today. We have two things. We have the Kronos 2.1, and Antonio and I have also gotten this, which is the, uh, I forget what brand it's called. Lawa. Or it's, it's Venus Lawa. Something I like that. I think the company is called Venus, but. It's on the box. Had this idea for a long time, probably too long. But have you ever cut your nails and you like, would sometimes get them to fling across and they'd be really fast and almost hit you in the face? Uh, that's what we're gonna use this for. And it's very dumb, I know. But I am curious to know what happens. So, uh, we're going to put the probe lens on the Kronos, and then I'm going to cut my nails. And we're going to see how it looks as I spit all over the place. Alright, so it mounts just like any other lens. Take it off the adapter. Take the cap off. And then... There you go. Line it up. And twist. Oh, wow, that is... It looks so funny. It's the pin... Oh, Jesus. <laughs> <laughs> it's the Pinocchio of lenses. <laughs> Here's the best part too. We don't know how, we know it turns on with, it has a little, here. Ooh. Has a little lights at the end. I don't know how useful they're gonna be, especially at F14 on the Kronos. So we have the, the sun, one of the Godoxes here to uh, give it more light. Do you think you're gonna be able to see anything? Oh, you actually can see something, surprisingly. It's more, it feels more like a Call of Duty gun attachment than a, uh, an actual lens. Okay, so it turns out we're scientists. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, look at this. We <laughs> rig this to the side, and it's just hanging off. And go ahead and there you go. show oh, us the power perfect. of the sun. <laughs> Holy crap. It doesn't show up on camera, but it is literally blinding. We're at ISO 80 right now, and it's still overexposed. <laughs> like, I'd have to crank... Well, wait, show the uh, Kronos, though. Cause wait, we... I'm, I'm at F22, <laughs> and I'm at 1000 ISO, and it's still, it's still blown out. But if you look at the camera, it's yeah. perfect. That looks really good. Hopefully that works out. If anything, I might need you to hit stop recording, because I don't think I could reach that fast on it. Wait, let me. <laughs> Three, yep. two, one. Okay, nothing happened. That that's fine. That's 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 normally how clipping nails works. Do you think this is what you're gonna be doing on your Friday night? No. Ugh, my eyes. <laughs> I know they are me too. No. I might have to do a different finger. I think I'm just making things worse for myself. Yeah, I'm just gonna cut this before I end up just... Yeah, please. <laughs> <laughs> Have you cut your nails before? Listen, listen. Oh, that was it. Holy shit, did you see it? Yeah. Wait for it. Oh, there it goes, holy shit. Can I do it again? Do you see it? All right, we got it. Holy shit. We're done. Look how, wait, wait, okay, wait. Think about this though, think about this. Look how fast this is here. This is at a thousand frames. Just think about that. And that's just a nail. Well, I'm not very good at math. So. Neither am I. We both failed calculus. <laughs> <laughs> is that what you wanted? Yeah, that's exactly what I wanted. I okay. didn't think we were going to get, okay. Didn't think we were going to get it that quick. That was at a thousand frames, which is 40 times slower than real life. Uh, oh this God. Is, this is pretty standard production for me. Uh, there was you know what this looks like? This is really bad lighting because it looks like when you shine the Oh, the flashlight here. There's that. Is that even? That's actually better. Uh, we've made some adjustments. I have. Uh, we've taped the box underneath the lens. If you want to get a good look at that. Um, so the, there's a bit of lens saggage. I can't see, it just looks like I'm looking into the sun. <laughs> well, can you at least see some of the box? Yeah, that's fine. Um, yeah, there was some lens saggage. Not enough, really, to be that much of a concern, but, you know, you really don't you can't want focus it. on it. <laughs> okay, well, it's there. You get the idea. Uh, the camera's squinting. <laughs> <laughs> so we're doing the same thing, but I have it set to uh, 800 by 640 at 5,500 frames. So oh, yeah, sure. if a thousand... Wait, what? I didn't know you could do that. Yeah, well, you can go up to 10,000, but the resolution's smaller. Yeah. So... It's going to be a smaller resolution, but it's 5,000, we'll just say 500 frames. If 1,000 times is about 40 times slower, 40 times 5 is uh, 200, and then, like, plus, you know, 
a half that's what 220 times slower around about 200. you lost me that's fine i think it's technically about 220 times slower in real life than real life uh, i'll put like a thing where i'll say i'm stupid or not above my head if that's close enough but i think i'm right on my slow-mo math with that being said because it's a smaller resolution it's also going to be darker but i mean it's still i don't think it looks too bad it's probably a little darker it doesn't look yeah, a little darker. Yeah, a little darker. All right, you're gonna have to again line me. That was it. I think that was actually it. God, I hope so. <laughs> me too. Oh my god. Okay, that's a, still fast. I think we got it though. Oh my god, that's so fast. Okay. I didn't think we would actually need to go. Okay, so. 200 times slower, and we're still like, you can see it like clip off to the side. And it's like still really um, super fast. Holy crap. Like, I don't want to go faster because I don't think I'll be able to steady my hand in such a small frame. Um, we'll just try it again. I'll, I'll try to, we'll try to get it a little bit lighter and a little bit wider. Is everything like in focus? Yeah. Ready? Yeah. Nope. Thumb. I don't think the thumb's gonna work. Oh, it worked. Was it in focus? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, Antonio. We gotta do it again. <laughs> this is what happens when you give two jackasses twenty thousand dollars worth of camera equipment. Ah, <laughs> oh, you have a great time. <laughs> is it in focus? <laughs> Can't. You are. <laughs> oh, great. Ready? That was it. I'm so confident that was it. And also, I'm I like... Know, it was dark as shit. Oh, you said it was clear. Hold on, let me... Oh, God, I can't. I, oh, I, like... I can't see from here because there's a glare. Oh. <laughs> Antonio. <laughs> well, no, I saw the shadow and I thought it, was, it wasn't going to be good. Okay, well, here. Oh, I'm glad we got it. Ready? Uh, here, let me. Okay, that's this is actually gonna be good. I can feel it. Ready? I'm not even moving. There we go. There we go. There you go. That was a good one. That, no, that's exactly what we wanted. Yeah, Holy crap! This. Huh? Yeah, literally like what? A width of a finger away, a toenail goes relatively fast, or I guess you could say it travels its length. A fingernail can travel about its length. I, I don't even know how fast that may be, actually. Which is weird, and it, it makes me sound stupid, but, like, everybody in... Again, everybody in their life at one point has clipped their toenails and had it fly across and almost hit you in the face or just, you know, make a ting off, like, the ground or something like that or, you know, wherever. You've heard it, it makes a sound, and in your, you have to wonder, like, oh, wow, that, like, hurt. Not hurt, but, you know, pinches you in the face, whatever. And uh, I'm actually... A, very surprised that like it is that fast to where a thousand frames is not enough to catch a, a fingernail being cut off and even at uh, 5,500 frames it's enough to catch it but it's still going awfully fast which actually makes me think uh, and this will be later so Antonio you're gonna love this this makes me think for later how fast does a fingernail crack uh, with fingernail toenail clippers. That's a question I'd like to find out. I don't think it'll be, it's no, you're looking at me like I'm evil. I'll just do an example. When I do this, that was a great one. But you heard it, Tang. But anyway, when I do this, when I'm cutting my fingernail, how fast is that crack happening? Like how fast is my fingernail being chopped away from my finger? But that's a question for another video. I'm actually very surprised that this one was as promising as it was. It, it seems very dumb. In fact, it, it is very dumb. I know that. But uh, there's something behind it, and I'm curious. And uh, this answered some of my curiosity. So that's going to be it for this one. Uh, hopefully this was a little bit more interesting. And uh, next time I think we're going to do more with the Pro Blends as well. I don't know what yet. I have a few ideas. Um, I know Antonio has a few ideas as well. But uh, yeah, we'll see you in the next one.